Hey guys, okay. So after four recording attempts, here I am outside of Grundy Industries. I blew open a window on the front side, Nick over the over one of the port thingies. And Banjo is down there. This is how I have to do it because it accidentally saved some of my stuff and I just have to explain what it was. On the other side, you will find or on this side you will find Banjo. And there's a I see him down. Well, I'll, I'll get to him eventually. Down there is Banjo. There's some claw climber boots in a box that I ran up the other side, that side, directly to the left. If I round that corner, uh, there's some claw climber boots that go up to a Jinjo. I will probably show those in a little bit. Right now, I'm just trying to get stuff together. Why am I having to do all this? Why the hell happened? Well, y you see, my computer has decided that it really doesn't like me and therefore I should suffer pain. So much pain. Um, yeah, so that happened. Yes. Okay, so in here, there is a flight pad. Why is this useful? Well, there's a video page right here. That's good. Oh, thank god it's recording that. Sorry, I had to, like, check because... Well, okay. It's story time. While I take this one flight pad up to a shortcut. Because useful. Now. Yeah. So... Wait a minute, where is it? Where is it? There it is. Come on, come on, come on. Ah, ah, my frame rate, it hurts. Ow, holy crap. Thank you, please die. Okay. So as I was saying before I almost died, there were a few complications yesterday, and please computer, don't, don't bug out on me again. Um, there were a few complications yesterday when I started recording this originally. I might have mentioned that in my, uh, if anybody saw my Facebook post. If you're not following me on Facebook, you might want to, because you know, you're awesome, I'm awesome, let's be awesome together and stuff. I think that's a Jinjo down there. Let's find out together. Ah, that's the problem here. Those things are in here. Yes! The Brown Jinjo family is complete. They'd like you to have our 50th Jiggy. Yeah. Okay, so that's good. Now, that's the only thing that's in here, I think. Oh, shite, there's a dust bunny in here. Um, well, we'll be back for him. We have to talk to them as a particular form. One moment. Okay. So, I had to... I had to close out of a couple pop-ups that came up to try and ruin my day. Um, what was I saying? Oh yeah. Okay, so for the first ten minutes of the recording I had absolutely no idea where I was actually going to go with it. And Grunty Industries is a terrible level to not have any idea what you're going to do. So I just sort of uh, had to look up what I was going to do and found a few tricks that I actually didn't know. One of which was, was finding the shortcut to that flight pad. And over here, we can use more exploits for the things. God, these, uh, clockwork things are just so useful. So, wait, there's a bunny in here. I thought the dust bunny was in. I heard one. Where is he? Okay, wait, 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 wait. I wanna find this dust bunny. Cause see, we gotta, okay. There's stuff we gotta do with those dust bunnies. It's just, whoa, 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 holy crap. Okay, what am I doing? What the hell am I doing? This is like the strangest recording I've ever made. Um, well, okay, maybe not, but. I feel like it should at least be close. Oing. And back out we go. Okay. So wait a minute. 
if we go... Uh, there's a few things I feel like we should do. For example... We walk around here, we'll find more stairs. And the stairs can be our best friend. Now, wait, what? Okay, I think I got distracted again. I'm just trying to focus because Kazooie has one HP and I think that's bad. But, um, I mean, okay. What I was doing yesterday was I tried to record this. Like, regularly tried to record this, you know, that sort of thing. Um, didn't work so well, as you may have found out, because I'm now recording this on another day. Obviously, it didn't work. Where are you? Ah. Now, Kazooie can run over here and activate this. Which activates easier to get to flight pads. Yes! Okay. So now there's that flight pad. And we got a quick cutscene. Hurry up and move before the thing comes back. Wait, where the hell is Banjo? Wait, okay, wait. I was jumping as Banjo. Then over here, there's one of these. That's just fine. Um, this is a lot of preliminary, this is how you get around stuff. <sighs> Are there any notes in here? No, I think that's a toxic portal. I know one of these is. There it is. Haha! -ha. So much use for the wing whack trick. But okay, we now have a shortcut down to the fourth floor. We need to do our other thing and go get our final shortcut. Which is extremely necessary. So I really hope I don't die or something. Or worse. This floor is very confusing. This floor is not your friend. That Jinjo. I really hate that Jinjo. Okay, so it wasn't the Jinjo, it was the Benjo, but I just wanted to kill it anyway. Um, those are notes. Okay, there's a reason we're on this floor. And... Oh, there's a reason we're on this floor. I mean, they didn't design this floor just to be a waste of time. I feel like they did for one of them, but... Well, actually, no, that isn't true of any floor of this. Um, I think I got sidetracked again. As I was saying about the, uh... Oh! Getting shite. Where's the... Where's the pad, Mambo? You magnificent bastard. Okay. There we go. Okay. You know what? I'm just gonna die, because... Stop. I'm just gonna die with Kazooie. That'll put us back at a point where we can go after I've activated all of those pads. So many pads! Okay. Good. Now we're Banjo Kazooie again. And there's Warp Pad over here, and we can actually get something done on this floor. Isn't that amazing? Because it seems to me like we were never allowed to get anything done. You know, if you ask me. But now we have access to basically every floor. So, yeah, but, okay, I think I was actually saying something again. Um, I was busy saying that, uh, I tried to record this yesterday, it didn't work. I ended up spending the first ten minutes wandering around without any idea what to do. And then I tried recording again and my computer randomly shut off as it did again about ten minutes ago. Ugh. Let me tell you how much I hate that. So much. However, battery, get back here. You will not charge me with battery. Ugh. Okay. So now we have a pack full again. But batteries, that's a big battery. Like, wait, why do they make batteries that big exactly? I don't understand. Again, there's a Globo up there. We should get it. Or something. We should do something with that Globo. 
something non. No, whoa, whoa, whoa. But I saw that before it was too late. Too late! Okay, that didn't work. You can make good use of Benjo's thing that I learned about really well around here. Ah, uh, no. No. Not oh, nuts. Okay. God. Alright. Place is driving me batty. But, you know, it's not so bad, I guess. I mean, okay, well, let me clarify my thoughts about this small world, world place. Because in the first two, all oh, rubbish, very European development, or very British development, as is the actual case with this power plant, or power plant, or order plant, or some kind of plant. Boiler plant, that's it. I can word. Okay, word up, G. Um. That's something we're gonna have to access. Can I beat that? I can! I can beat that into submission. And now we have access through the elevator shaft to the third floor. Which, let me tell you how good that is. I Take that, bitch! And that's what I mean when they can get really bad. But once they, you know, that did sort of give us a level up. Like that thing up. There is a Jinjo up there, and we will be exploiting a trick to get to him again. However, we need to power this. So, another battery. Additional battery power to the door. Access is now granted. And stuff. Floaty chain swap clouds. Whew, okay. And Kazooie can easily get through this. Because Kazooie is awesome. Now, Kazooie is the one you need to actually get this Globo. Because she can just leg spring up to it. Ow. Okay, wait, wait. Ow. Ow. What's that? Okay, wait a minute. We got that. So much leg spring. It can basically do everything for you, though. Is it just big gap, leg spring, big gap, leg spring, other big gap? Okay, it just lets you cross a big period. Let's you get across. Okay. <laughs> let's you get up boxes and big jumps that you would normally not be able to do. There. That's what I wanted to say. That's all I wanted to say. More exploitation of this. Yes! And we have four to five green gingos now. Okay. Good. Now we're actually going to get a jig. Isn't that amazing? All this crap. And we're finally about to get a jig. Banjo's right there, but you want to go in here. Oh. Uh, red, green, and blue. What does this sound like? Bring me back in the just been located. Game rules are available if required. No. Basically, you gotta sort the twinkies. I'll show you what to do. Got a red one. Get all the fastness. Okay. You know, I feel like they should have learned from their multicolored light challenges already. I mean, we already had the dodging challenge where we had to grab the twinklies anyway. What is it with rareware and light bulbs? I mean, Christmas lights. It's like. We sorted enough of these creeps with my mind. Is this where they go? Is this where that box of Twinklies came from? That really curiousifies me. It's like, you know, in Banjo Kazooie, we start that thing of Twinklies. But, where did they come from, anyway? Did they, they come from here? Because that was just a random box of Twinklies sitting out in the middle of Christmas land. But, you know, stuff. Damn you! Ah, wait. Oh. Yes, we succeeded. I think you only have to get 40. A bonus will not be awarded. Yes. Okay. Ah. So let's take that jiggy. We now have two out of eight here. No, I don't really... That one, that one really isn't my cup of tea. Let's not play it again. Oh. Okay. Weekly challenge completed. So good. Um, let's just find Banjo. Okay, now that we have Banjo and we're up here, we can uh, actually get something done. Well, we did just get something done. We got a Jiggy. We also did a lot of Kazooie. A lot, a lot. We actually got two Jiggies. That's right, we got another Jiggy. We got one on top. Cool. So we now have three Jiggies in this place, because the last time, if you remember, 
But you might not. We got the, uh, uh, um, well, okay, what is this unlocking? Ah, okay. Remember that room with the giant magnet? That goes to the room with the giant magnet. And we're gonna need that combo pad to actually do something with the giant magnet. So Mumbo gets to shine again. And... Boom! That's now in that room forever. And I'm still gonna have to show where the notes go at the end of this video. Which, most of the... I'll probably put a couple of these up tomorrow to make up for my not having videos lately. Um... But I don't think there's really anything else we can do in here. Um... That's just light from the boiler. There really isn't anything else. Unless something goes... Wait a minute. Uh, well, I can't exactly jump in there, so never mind. Okay. So... We're just gonna have to go out this way, back to the third floor, and find our way around. Because there's something to do in here. Oh, wait a minute. So there's that. Uh, hello? Aha! So we now have wasted a whole bunch of clockwork eggs, but we have all three honeycombs on this level. I think. Don't we? Back to the totals thing. Yes, we got all three honeycombs, three jiggies, three moves, four gingos, most of the notes, some of which I'll have to show off screen because they got this off screen. Both globos, which one of them I got off screen, but I'll show you where it was. Um, and two Tito pages. We just need lots of jiggies. Okay. So, I think that's a good point to end this part. In the next part, we will explore more of Grundy Industries. See you guys then!